This week in the galley, we're down at Hotel Buena Vista, down the beautiful East Cape, where we've been filming all week, catching lots of fish. And standing next to me is Felipe. Felipe, thanks for helping us out again. Hello, man. Welcome back. And we have your chef today with us. Yes, Chino's uh, preparing a, a ceviche of tuna. Cool. Yeah. So what he's doing right now is cutting the tuna up. A little bit different. It's not like the common. You guys few uh, different ingredients to to the typical um, ceviche. You actually uh, add the uh, red craft peppers, like the ones you use on the for your pizzas. Sesame seed oil, soy sauce. It changed a little bit, and it's just to um, to make it uh, more according to to tuna flavor, no? Okay. So now we put it all in one bowl. Uh huh. Now, now that he has all the uh, ingredients chopped, the tomato, the red onions, and the cilantro, he's gonna keep adding the, um, the salt, the olive oil, the uh, sesame seed oil, soy sauce. All of those are- Different ingredients to assemble it. Uh-huh, it's uh, of depending how much you will like mm -hmm. of that flavor. So it's up to you how much you put in. And if you're not familiar with ceviche, it's a typical Mexican dish, it's a traditional dish and you don't use a flame on the fish. All the fish is cooked with the lime and lemon juices. And that's what he's gonna do right now. He's gonna go ahead and put the lime in there. And it'll actually, you'll see the, the fish actually change color, turn a light color. And it's already happening now. It's already starting to turn white. And just put a little bit in there. Already getting lighter. Okay, now he's going to add the pepper. Olive oil. A little bit of sesame seed oil. Never tried that before. Is this soy sauce? Soy sauce. A little bit of salt. So you just mix this all together and that's basically it. That's it. You put it on the on the fridge for 10, 15 minutes. Mm -hmm. Just to cool it up. And break it down. Break so. it down. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sometimes when I make ceviche, I'll do it the night before, serve the next day. Exactly. All right, after it's done and everything is mixed, how, this is how we this is the finished dish. That's the finished dish. And this one has already been sitting in the refrigerator for about an hour. You guys yes. did earlier. So I gotta try this out. This simple ceviche dish. Tuna. Uh, you can taste all that. I've never tasted with sesame seed oil. And definitely taste the soy sauce. Mm -hmm. and glasses. Yeah. Then glasses. Pleasure. A great dish. And if you wanna taste a ceviche dish like this, it's easy you can do at home, but it's way more fun. You come down here. Hotel Buena Vista, catch your own tuna, and they'll cook it up for you this way. Mm -hmm. Great. Well, let's get back on the water and show you more exciting action down here in the beautiful East Cape here on Sport Fishing.